Hi friends. Good morning and welcome to the Gospel Reflections. Today gospel begins with the Jesus prayer of thanksgiving to God. In this prayer of blessing or thanksgiving, Jesus contrasts those who consider themselves wise and intelligent with those who are truly wise, the little ones who know their daily struggle to survive. And it is to these that the secrets of God's kingdom have been revealed. God is beyond the reach of those who pride themselves as intellectuals. He often reveals himself to the humble and marginalized. Jesus is well aware of the mental stress people undergo. Often they are lonely and do not find an outlet to let go of their tensions and anxieties. Knowing well about such situations, Jesus said, "Come to me all of you who are tired from carrying heavy loads and I will give you rest." Friends, sometimes we need to be reminded that we are human beings and not human doings. Our value depends not on what we achieve or accomplish but in the fact that we are children of God whose spirit dwells with him. Unfortunately, the world judges differently. It values those who are most productive, great achievers, or those who garner wealth. Time spent refreshing life, praying, caring for family, sharing quality time, or just relaxing is considered wasted time. This mindset can lead to think and consider the elderly, the disabled and the unborn as having no value as such, for they are not productive at this stage. However, the followers of Jesus value such people all the more, for Jesus has chosen them as his own. He wants us, his modern day disciples, to develop virtues of gentleness, loving service, and generosity. God has characterized himself as meek and humble of heart. God does not desire to intimidate people, but instead he encourages them to gravitate to him and gives rest to those burdened and tired. And the Lord expects us in turn to provide rest and comfort to those who are equally tired and burdened the invitation of jesus to come to him is issued to those who are weary and burdened and that includes most of us at some time or other the invitation of jesus allows us to be free and to open ourselves to the ever new possibilities and to be there for others how can this be Jesus says learn of me for i am gentle and humble of heart the gentle is said to be blessed there is nothing weak about being gentle the non violent methods of the gentle are infinitely more effective in restoring creation than the violence of so many who present themselves as wise intelligent and progressive Resting with God is the source of the power of the gentle ones and may it be our source of power as well. Thank you for listening to God's word. This is Father Jimmy Matthew Mission Director FRC Philippines. Remember, the family that prays together stays together. Wish you a graceful week. See you again next week. Bye for now and God bless. Thank you.